This is Abby. She likes hanging out in the sun. I am in the IMAX theater for Moonfall. I was gonna wait till I got out of the into the car in the parking lot to say this, but it's one of the worst movies I've ever seen in my life. This thing was awful. Wow. Oh, all right, I'm in my car back uh, after the theater. Trying to warm up. It's gonna be a minute before this thing warms up anyway, so. I actually stuck around to the end to see legit one of the worst movies I think I've ever seen. Like when I think about my the worst movies I've ever seen, Open Water and The Diving Bell and the Butterfly come to mind, but this is, this is something else, man. It's like devoid of any character, devoid of any like emotion, and they try for them all. None of it works, man. This is... I mean, I don't love Roland Emmerich, but I remember being a big fan of Stargate and Independence Day was, as cheesy and corny as it is, one of my favorite movies of all time growing up. I marked out for Godzilla, even though that was wrong. Day After Tomorrow was a hell of, like, a thrill ride and, um, uh, you know, a disaster movie. Um, what else? Oh, 2012? Didn't he do 2012, like another disaster movie? So I'm just thinking this is gonna be, you know, 2012 or like Independence Day, but with the moon, too. And I think there's gonna be a sequel. I think they set up a sequel. I, I am flabbergasted at what I just watched. Moonfall in IMAX, directed by Roland Emmerich, starring Halle Berry. What? Patrick Wilson, what? I don't know, man. I don't know. You know, and I... I liked it better when there were miniatures and they were getting blown up and destroyed. With computer graphics, like, not even everything looks so clean. It still just doesn't look real enough. It's weird to say, right? Dude, I don't want to go into spoilers for the Moonfall thing, but... Outrageous.